How to create WhatsApp forms? Hello and welcome to our channel WebWiz. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create WhatsApp forms. So please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial. So today we are gonna use this tool, WhatsApp form, that this platform is gonna allow you to create forms to connect directly to your WhatsApp. Because probably you already have a knowledge of Google Forms. So this is basically what we're gonna do today. A form perhaps like this party invitation. So the person, the people are gonna be able to check the multiple questions to submit some text if it's needed and to send this and you're gonna be able to see the responses. But this tool, What's Form, is connected with WhatsApp. Okay, so what you must do, I'm gonna try the demo, so I'm gonna let you know how it works. So this is the demo that they let us see. So you must do, in this form, this was created, so I must do write my name, and what would you like to order? I don't know, the red velvet. So submit on WhatsApp, and you're gonna receive this, okay? This is what you're gonna receive on WhatsApp. But by now I'm going to create a more complex form so you're gonna be able to see and to view how you're gonna receive the info. I want to show you the pricing too of this tool. You could use it for free. You could create five forms and the responses via WhatsApp are gonna be unlimited. If you want to create more forms, you would have to pay $12 per month. And this is gonna allow you to see the responses in the dashboard of this platform and also the custom CEO meta data. Or you could select um, more complex packages like the standard or plus. This is on you, but by now I'm going to log in and to create a form. I already um, had the login. What you must do is select your country, your mobile, your number phone, and that's it. In that way, you're going to get until to, to this uh, page. And obviously, to create a new web form, here you can switch the language to Portuguese, Spanish, or Indonesian. But by now, I'm going to create a new WhatsApp form. Again, your number, WhatsApp number, the language, and next. So you can start from scratch, or you could use a template, or copy a form from Google, like the part invitation that I already showed you. By now, I'm going to use a template, because this is going to save us some time, and I'm going to use a template of the travel booking. So... I'm going to be right now like a manager of an of an agency. And let me see. So this is the template. So make an inquiry. Once you fill the form, we will get in touch with you to confirm your travel requirements. So are you looking for there are some other options, your full name, contact email, location, etc. There are a lot of questions. But at the left, to the left, we have a menu with different options. So, for instance, this is a make an inquiry. This is the title. So, you, if you want to create one form from scratch, you must drag and drop the title here and add a title. So, uh, I don't know. Your travel is close. And here the description. Select your desired, I don't know, country perhaps. I'm going to delete this by now, but I just wanted to show you that this one is a title. This one, for instance, is an image. So here again, image, drag and drop. And that's it. You must add the image here or with a link. You can add a title to the image and an image caption. So I'm gonna show you if I want to make a title of my of the name of my agency. So perhaps traveling 
Around the World is the name of my agency and your dreams can come true. I don't know. It's just an example. Okay. This one is a multiple choice, so the same. I'm going to show you. Here you can select the, the title of this question. Here it is, are you looking for? And you could add a lot of options, okay? You can select this option too. Perhaps you are here, I don't know, international travel, honeymoon, local tourism, family, other. So the person is going to click on this and is going to be able to uh, feel some more data the specific that the person wants your full name this is important because this is the text input so again drag and drop but this has the red the for required so all these options have this option the required so the person is not going to be able to send this if doesn't feel these bars so it is required the contact email again the text input or here email you can drag and drop it's the same it is really easy to create this form there are some other options to see here here for instance how many adults are traveling so the placeholder text is like an option to show you in this bar so if we suppose that my that my agency is specialized in uh, traveling with kids so this is gonna be this is not gonna be zero by at least it's gonna be one okay so you could feel like some suggestions in the placeholder text mm, the date is this one the drop down is similar to multiple choice the difference is that you're going to have like a list if you click in an arrow so you're gonna be able to see the list but it's, it is the same okay the, these are the options I'm going to let these by now in this way I'm not going to make any changes and last but not less important the preview so here in the preview you're gonna be able to see it in the desktop so the person is gonna receive this in the mobile and I'm not sure what is which yet. I don't know, but here you can see it and you can feel it like an example, okay? Obviously, you're not gonna be able to send it by here because you must publish your form. So your what's form is published, okay? So I'm going back to show you, let me see the dashboard. So here, I have the booking template and I can share this. This is the URL that you must copy to send to your contacts. So by now I'm going to open a new tab. I'm going to fill it. So you're going to be able to know. I'm going to travel with 12 gets. Do you have a destination on your mind? Yes, I want to go to New York. I want to travel on August. This is a travel around two weeks. Any other comments? Um, I don't know. Peanut allergic. And choose a date or date and time. I don't know. I don't know why this is, but I'm going to submit on WhatsApp the person is going to be directed to this part okay so the booking template response are you looking for so there you're going to have all the responses okay in this way so it's going to be directed into your whatsapp i'm going to delete this by now and here I'm going back. I'm really sure that I have, yeah, one responses. Obviously, this dashboard, I'm not going to be able to see this because this 
responses in dashboard is just available uh, if you pay at least $12 per month. So I really recommend you to upgrade your plan if you want it because this is a powerful tool that you're going to be using with your WhatsApp. And that's it. That's how you can create WhatsApp form with WhatsApp form. Thanks for watching.